Hello, babies. We are Welcome to the stream! And the crowds go wild as Nancy Drew runs onto the field. One key in hand. Six key. Six, did I say one can? One key in hand? That's what I meant to say. One key in hand. Six keys Let's to go. go. Um, the, um, Juliet says... Leo is crispy loud. Juliet says, oh honestly, God. both Shut loud. Up. Should we be less loud? I can make us less loud. I mean, we also came in like swinging yeah, at a volume a that we wild. don't uh, normally. <laughs> yeah, uh, the stream settings are the same as they've been the last few weeks since I made it louder yeah no nothing uh, nothing has changed we just, we just uh we we came out swinging today the hint deputy is gone and so emily was the one thing keeping us in check and on track so i hope you're ready for a whole two hours of loud ass tangents wow oh <laughs> <laughs> uh, wow Emma says, hey, I've been deputized. Get to work, fuckos. <laughs> oh, shit. Okay. Well, I guess we'll do a normal calm demure stream today then. Uh, um, thank you for the joke suggestion earlier, Juliet, before we were fully here. Um, I'll try to say it at an appropriate time at some point. Um, what are we, do you want to talk about game yet? Or do you have any berry cast topics? Can we talk about my beautiful potato? Did you yeah, see my beautiful it was potato? Beautiful. Bro, that sauce, like truly, I cannot communicate how good it smelled. It looked like it was like a lovely, glossy, brown sauce like very caramely consistency mm -hmm. it just smelled so good like so nutty from the brown butter and a little spicy and a little salty just perfect wow that's all that's my potato okay. potato news um speaking of gochujang uh francis did make me gochujang pasta this past week <gasps> yum it was fucking delicious that sounds great. I had forgotten about that already. Yeah, Maybe I'll make gochujang pasta. The food channel tonight. I know that you did. Um, yeah. I'm having big uh, ba baby hours. If something is not immediately in front of me, it no longer exists. Yeah, I get it. <laughs> um, that's it. I just I really wanted uh, praise potato praise for my beautiful yeah, potato. You're potato is beautiful thank you um i'm working on my mystery knit along shawl i finally are you knitting during the stream that's naughty uh only during berry cast until i have to like move the mouse around and stuff <laughs> until i have to play a video game Ugh. yeah <laughs> um, i was telling wesley before we started that I managed to break not one, but two of Emma's knitting needles in the last week. Like, Absolute by criminal behavior. I know. Well, it's it's not intentional. It just, this is what it must feel like to be like the over-enthusiastic family lab who's always knocking things off uh -huh. the table with the tail. Yeah. I was just trying to sit on the couch multiple times. Yeah. Um, I feel like I had a berry cast thing to say. Oh, maybe. I don't know. Um, we're, there are various shows in rotation sort of right now, but we are continuing Doctor our Who. Doctor Who watch through. So we're in, we're in Peter Capaldi era. Um, in his 
second season, maybe, maybe third. It feels honestly like it's been like three seasons already and he should be wrapping up. Because it's so warm, uncomfortable or because it's so... wrapping up. Ah, okay. I don't know. I don't even like, I don't... I don't think I dislike Peter Capaldi um, or his iteration of the doctor. I mean, I think his iteration of the doctor is less likable in various ways. Like he is more um, arrogant and less person centered. (laughs) Yeah. Um, My only term. My only, because I have not watched any of the Peter Capaldi, mm, and mm-hmm. it was Peter Capaldi. Uh, am I getting my Doctor Who timeline right? It ended up being Peter Capaldi when the rumor was that it was going to be Idris Elba, right? Oh, I or was am that the Doctor sure. before? I don't know if that was him or Jody. Foster. I thought not, it was Capaldi, not Jodie but... Foster. Oh, that Jody. Um, <laughs> yeah, the other Jody. Yeah, and not Jodie Comer either. Those are the two names that I'm like, okay, Foster is the one I go for first. I'm like, it's not Whitaker? that. And then is it Whitaker? yes, it's Whitaker. And then the only other one I huh. can think of is Comer. And I'm like, I know it's not that. <laughs> but yes, Jodie Whitaker. I don't remember. Juliet says, is Capaldi Doctor less intolerable than Matt Smith Doctor? Honestly, I ended up really liking Matt Smith Doctor in a lot of ways. I just hated the show writing. Yeah, that's how I felt about Matt Smith Doctor Run 2. It's like, some of it, I don't know, he's he's a little twee, and I don't mind twee, but I felt like twee with the direction of the show running was... It was just such a lethal combination. Yeah. Um, but I I feel like I, what Francis has said is like he does a great job of feeling really unhuman. Like, I Sorry, don't know. Sorry, Smith or Capaldi? Smith. Hmm. Hmm. Like, I don't know, like he walks in and he's talking about stuff and he's just like existing in a different world than everyone around him. Interesting. It's been, it's been a long time. I feel like he just has such (laughs) off the charts theater kid energy. It's like, yes, he comes from the dimension of theater kids. Yeah, Um, I mean, that, that, like, that's part of it. (laughs) I think. But, um, yeah. Nat says, I love Capaldi. I thought he was so fun. I mean, there are definitely, like, I, yeah, like I said, I don't think I dislike him or his iteration of the Doctor, but I still... I'm frustrated with the show writing. Um, It's less of that, uh, like, we just need to, like, I don't know, love or believe in each other or whatever, and the world will be saved. And more just like, I don't know, it feels so all over the place. I guess since you never saw any Capaldi, you also never saw any Missy. Um, yeah, I, I have no idea who Missy is. Well, spoilers for Doctor Who season. I don't know what, uh, coming right now. Missy is the master. Oh, Um, master's back. Yes. Master's back as woman. Um, and she has like deranged horny mary poppins energy okay deranged horny mary poppins sure yeah um 
and is that's, like that's really, interesting with Capaldi because really, I feel like, like that could be really fun playing off of Matt Smith's like weird twee manic. Mm-hmm. Um, I just does it have to be the master again, <laughs> right? Uh, she's very flirty with the doctor, um, and. But, like, okay, here's an example of some of what they're doing with the writing. Um, There's this whole arc with Missy where, like, she's been uploading people's consciousnesses when they die to, like, a little, I don't know, cyber sphere. And then she finds a way of converting every dead body into a cyberman and then like re-downloads downloads the consciousnesses into those cyberman bodies um and when i say every dead body i mean every person who has ever died in the world yeah and at one point okay. like the director of unit is like how like the doctor says she's been doing this for a long time and the director of unit is like how long and the doctor is like how long have humans had a conception of the afterlife and i'm like no i'm sorry like do not do this thing where like you take like okay in in blink in the first weeping angels episode they do this in in a fun way right at the end of the episode it's sort of like any statue like could be a weeping angel and it's like a little spooky and a little fun and that worked really well in that episode and then it's like they're just like let's do that (laughs) repeatedly um where we take some I don't know, fundamental part of human existence and uh, make you realize that the master was behind it all along. Yeah. I mean, it's just, it's the comic book. It's the comic book problem. It's the, like, unending serialization problem. Mm -hmm. I don't know. I Just even in you describing very briefly this, like, this is what's been happening, I could just feel my eyes glazing over. (laughs) Yeah. Um, um Juliet did say oh and then oh in all yeah, capitals I assume that horny Mary horny Mary Poppins yeah mm-hmm, yeah yeah um unfortunately I mean that in the most derogatory way possible <laughs> damn like I love Mary Poppins <laughs> they do literally have her float down out of the sky on an umbrella at one point um Oh, so just like explicitly. Yes. Yeah. Juliet says, I mean, if she's mean and hot enough, I could be swayed. I mean, I don't know what sort of she's certainly mean. Depends on like what you think is hot. I don't know if she's mean in a way that you would be into. I personally I'm not not really a fan well thanks for the doctor who update you're welcome um, you guys have fun with that i'm just watching black sales again for like the fourth time i think oh wow like okay. us to go mm-hmm um, Shall we do a last time on, or do you have other wrap up who or Barry thoughts? Oh, I was just remembering. There's something I've watched, something I've rewatched in the last couple years that has the guy who plays Captain Flint in it. Oh yeah, I think it's um, Toby's. 
Yeah, is it a Toby Stevens. Uh, Jane Austen adaptation? Yeah, he's in... Um... I feel like he's in either a, a version of Sense and Sensibility or Persuasion, and I don't remember which one. Yeah, that... Um, oh, he's in the... Um... I can see the cover of it. Um, he's in he's in the Jane oh, Eyre or... with um. Oh well, I haven't watched he's in... any Jane Eyre. He's in the Jane Eyre with um with Ruth Wilson, who is another like person who I find weirdly compelling, especially when she's playing like horrible roles. Like she's Ruth Wilson is um. Mrs. Coulter and the good HBO, his Dark Materials adaptation. A, a, a role in which she is like the ultimate compelling, like mean woman. Wow. Well, I haven't seen that. Um, I'm not thinking of him in Jane Eyre because I have not watched that. Oh, he's in the Tenant of Wildfell Hall too, which I think I have seen, but not in a really long time. Um, oh, that's, it's Twelfth Night. He's in the weird Twelfth Night. The weird, I say weird because you described it that way at one point. The Twelfth Night that we watched together years ago now. Uh, he is the Duke Josh Orsino. Whedon one? No. Josh, Josh, Josh Whedon. No. <laughs> John, <laughs> <laughs> Joss Whedon. Did Joss Whedon do Twelfth Night? He did. Um, oh, he, he did, did the much. He did. He did much ado. Much ado. Yeah. No, I'm talking about the Twelfth Night with um, Ben Kingsley as the jester. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. And Helena Bonham Carter as yeah, the per yeah. yes, 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 and Captain Flint toby yeah he is orsino in is that. you're right orsino. You're, yeah that's the one with richard grant and like imelda staunton and like everyone probably um it's just funny because like i saw that long before Why did i, I saw describe black that sales, one as weird but i didn't recognize him in black sales but then like when i went back and watched 12th night again i was like oh <laughs> there he is <laughs> there he is i'm still th i'm still thinking about josh whedon <laughs> um oh juliet says oh by the way i read a Kafka short story this week. It took me three days of reading to get through 20 pages because Kafka's writing, it's gosh darn Kafka-esque. Um, it was called Josephine the Songstress or the Mouse Folk. Okay, I understand why you would have wanted to read that. Um, and it was Kafka's final short story before dying and the singular one, which he asked to be not burned after his death. And now that I've read it, I see it everywhere. The true curse of literature. Um, Emma says, Juliet, are you telling me Kafka wrote a mouse furry story for mouse furries? <laughs> and it sounds like it. <laughs> um, Juliet says, maybe, but he wrote it. So the only way you'd think it was about mouse furries is the title. The story is like intentionally... Uh, could be applied to a population of mice or people. Okay. Uh, Lily watched that Twelfth Night adaptation in English class in high school. Yeah, I like that Twelfth Night. I don't know why. In what way did I describe it as weird? Do you I remember? I don't know. I don't know. It just stuck out in your mind that I called it weird? Yeah. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. I probably talked about this a while ago when we watched them back to back, but Francis and I watched that one and the 1970s one um, mm -hmm. with Felicity Kendall as Viola. Um, and the Felicity Kendall one has incredible chemistry between Viola as you know cesario and 
the Countess Olivia um, and the whenever that one came out the one we were just talking 1996. about 1996 like really leans into the homoeroticism between the duke and viola as cesario um yeah yeah damn like real i mean they they are so obviously horny for each other while he still thinks she's a man that's just the bros yeah um okay that's been uh you know media opinions with wesley all right okay do you last time on yeah do you remember do you remember in the game um we found the weird lockbox in um grandpa geppetto's (laughs) puppet pawn shop Uh uh-huh um that we did a series of like secret button pushes to open and there's a puppet in there, but we haven't fully gotten in there. Um, yes. We're trying to find the key schematics, which would be in the old alchemy workshop. We looked at some symbols. Oh, oh, on the, on the fucking Da Vinci code codex. Yeah. The artifact. Yeah, what was what was in there? We haven't opened. Are it we yet. not in there yet? We We're haven't opened it yet. yet. Okay, that's right. We just deciphered the little symbols. Yeah, that's. What I think we're that's doing it. Next. Not that much See? like plot solve happened. Riddle. Yeah, solve riddle because we're gonna use that gla- the riddle on the glass plaque to determine the order for this. Oh right, because box. we saw the mosaic on the church facade with the um, snake, Adam and Eve and the snake. Yes. Okay. Okay. Wow, we're doing so good at remembering um, with one neat trick that local doctors hate actually stream every week <laughs> instead of going <laughs> weeks in between. Uh, okay. Um, I'm not done with that yet. Wow, can't check that off yet. Still- hey! <laughs> Still, I'm not done with that yet. If we were different kinds of streamers, this is where you would have a soundboard with like a national anthem playing. Yeah. Um, okay. I just wanted to, you know, go through do a little check things. Check in. Yeah. Hey. (laughs) Okay. So search for our mark to unriddle the box order the symbols then brilliant oh that was a big one bro that was a big one bro (laughs) yeah i feel like i need to like my voice is changing but i'm still doing the same things with it that i used to and i need to actually like practice like letting it be lower i think yeah it just feels so weird to practice like it's hard to practice and feel authentic about it you know let's let's do this whole but, stream lower than we normally oh God, do i don't know if i can do that <laughs> hey what's up thanks for coming out it's your boys wes and leo we're gonna play some fortnite hang out with the bros crack a cold one yeah a cold artifact from alchemy times hey good one bro good one <laughs> um yeah, it's it's weird. You'll get used to yeah. it. <clears throat> okay. Seek first the jeweled craft of the father of Cain. Follow the path of the creature Iosis along Golden Lane. Find Oh, and Iosis symbol. the creature of Iosis is the serpent from the thing. Yes, I think so. Find the symbol of he who bestowed the honor of night like with a K. 
Then the winding stars find whose omen strikes at midnight. This this really is the poetry equivalent of like the John Mulaney bit about writing a happy birthday sign. <laughs> Just starting out so confidently and the uh-huh. spacing really getting away from you. Yeah. Um. Okay, so. The jeweled craft of the father of Cain. Does he. That is a priceless artifact. Don't forget. Yeah, yeah. Is it. Trees? We went through and looked at. Um, I don't think I wrote down, like, what. Because there's a bunch of options in each. Oh my god, do I have to redo the thing? Oh, no, I don't. Okay. Oh, it's that. Oh, jeweled. Yeah. Right. It's that. But that's the, apple. the second one. What's the second? Hold on. Or, wait, no. That is the first one. Right? And the second is supposed to be the serpent. That's what I'm saying. Can we go look at it? I don't remember the order. <sighs> okay. Um... Yes. First. Okay, so the first craft apple orb whatever. Yeah. And to then follow the, the path of the creature Iothis. Or Boros or is yeah. it just serpent? It says serpent slash Ouroboros. Okay. Um find the symbol of he who bestowed the honor of night. Then the winding stars find whose omen strikes at midnight. Okay, for the winding stars. Midnight omen, okay. That implies to me it's like what symbol is on the alchemical clock at midnight. But we can't, they, this mm. game is so opposed to us actually looking at the fucking clock, yeah. right? Like with the winding. Uh-huh. Okay, what do you think about, um, the, he who bestows the honor of night? Do you think it's one of the kings, like, that we can look at in this room? Yeah, because it could could be, like, the double-headed eagle, which is, like, the state emblem i'm wondering if we mm. need to reread the um what's his name sir nicholas the sad or whatever the violin player <laughs> who dies. sir nicholas the sad um, <laughs> yeah it's sir something um just because that's the only like notable knight i think that we've encountered unless they're being more abstract than that There he is. Yeah, there it is. The night. Dalabar. Oh, in the moonlight, it is said the night transforms. So beware of the mournful cries of the night. Transforms into what? I don't know. Okay, so his Um, crest is a little sing is a single sided eagle and some coins. Yeah, but he doesn't bestow the honor oh, of his knight. Honor, like, yeah. he didn't make himself a knight, presumably. Yeah. Okay, and that doesn't say anything. Um. <laughs> Francis says, oh, sad Nick. Oh. More a part of St. Vitus Cathedral's treasury than the jewel collection, the sword of St. Wenceslas and the reliquary cross were used mostly in coronations and knighthoods. Oh, so sword or... Maybe. I mean, the symbol of St. Wenceslas. I don't know if that is... 
Yeah. The sword. And then it's the Golden Reliquary Cross was commissioned by Charles the Fourth. Um the royal apple. I'm pissed that they put these fucking interactive exhibit things here and we can't interact with them. Just yeah. don't have them. Yeah. Um. <laughs> Emma says, please, Frankie, that's Sir Old Sad Nick. <laughs> Francis apologizes and Emma says, it's okay. He's used to disappointment. Damn. Um. Oh, let's yeah. let's look, look at what our options see, this talks about um the apple is gilded with latin scripture and scenes from the book of genesis a depiction of adam and eve in the garden of eden biblical parents of cain and abel embellishes the lower hemisphere a scene that parallels prague castle courtyard's golden gate on saint vitus cathedral exterior i'm glad that they textually told us who cain's parents were otherwise we wouldn't have had that information yeah um let's look at what our symbol options are for three yeah. and four and maybe that will be illuminating okay um i'm just i'm just skimming what is here yeah that's fine i'll allow it What the chat doesn't know is that Wesley drives Nancy, but I drive I Wesley with a mouse. <laughs> Very complicated. Okay, so we've got unicorn. We've got bird. We've got double-headed eagle. We've got trees. I'm going to say it's the double-headed eagle. Double-headed eagle. Yeah. And then, and then the midnight okay. omen. Yes. What? So we've got stag. We've got trees. We've got <gasps> mm, skeleton. We know the there's a skeleton at the. Yeah, I think it's a lantern. <laughs> uh, I think it's a cage for your soul. Oh shit! stars find whose omen strikes at midnight no oh wait no hold on hold on what i'm wondering if our because see sorry that is so loud take your gigantic engine away please um is that getting picked up no not significantly okay um I'm wondering, actually, if the last line is because the winding stars could also refer to the codex itself. Yeah, that's what I was just thinking. Um, Seek first the jeweled craft of the father of Cain. Follow the path of the creature Iosis along Golden Lane. I think it's along Golden Lane because that's the row that has that all the alchemy symbols. Don't yeah, don't. which like was golden lane was like the alchemy road right 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 yeah um yeah find the symbol of he who bestows <laughs> honor fuck julian nice. says about me controlling you with a mouse you say <laughs> and francis says it's just like that movie mouse <laughs> wow um <laughs> Yeah, so... Because our, just... our extant order can't be right because this any of the options on the bottom row have not unlocked. Oh. Right? Oh. Oh, that did it. This it was death. Mark on it. Yeah, na yeah, Nance. I'll have to come find these when Oscar isn't around. <laughs> Hell yeah. <laughs> um, hey... 
Do you think these go in our weird puppet hell box? Yeah. Our puppet coffin? Yeah. Wow, that's thrilling. At least one of them does. Hey, what? You. What actually opened it? The artifact? What do you mean? I hope you don't mind. It's kind of what I do. <laughs> it does not appear to be damaged, and I had been looking forward to seeing inside. Just make no habit of touching exhibits. I understand. I am curious, though. We found it in the original royal palace structure in the tunnels beneath the castle complex recently. Mm. It dates back to the 9th and 10th century. What are these tunnels? You have not heard? Tunnels beneath Prague. From the times of nobles and kings. We're in the process of restoring them, but not all are safe. Oh, really, the Oscar? Seems very old. Whose was it? Rudolf II. You will not know he ruled from 1576 <laughs> to 1612, I believe. Oh, yes, as Holy Roman Emperor. How did you deduce that? You could say I am professionally interested. We found a note in the same tunnel from a council in his court. Lehman. He helped hide the artifact before the end of his reign. Now that it's open, what will you do with the artifact? I will keep it here until I am able to examine it privately and enter it into Degas. What difference is it to you? No more questions. I must go. Please view the exhibits that are open to you. <laughs> Damn. Um, is it just we didn't linger on any of the symbols long enough, or did no, you like I touch to, something like, at the bottom? Like I clicked somewhere. Ah, okay, okay. Um, yeah. Nat says, "Take those gems." Emma says, Nancy Jewel Thief era. Yeah. Um, How do we make Oscar go away? Good question. Oscar said that tunnels beneath the city were created by floods. Wait, did he say that? And I just totally missed it right now. Uh, In that conversation? About the tunnels. Yeah, he said something about the tunnels. I distinctly do not remember him mentioning floods. Yeah, I don't know. Francis says he's awfully rude considering considering we just opened a special thing for him and then kill him. <laughs> Great. That's done. Um check. Republic. We just have to come up with an excuse to have um, Vladena walk past and then they'll oh, get yeah. distracted. Uh -huh. Yeah. Wait, we did that. I'm not done Ugh. with that yet. Right. I remember. Okay. No, we need to get in there yeah. more. Wait, can we not open, can we not check off that sub task no, within there and take a closer look? What oh, I just tried. I thought you were clicking no. on the open I'm not trunk. I'm done with that yet. <sighs> um... Oh, you again. Okay. What should we do now? Oh, maybe um, we talk to Radic. Sure. Yeah, we haven't talked to him. We need, I assume, time to progress. Yeah, but we also are supposed to, like, learn more about the Resident Day. Yeah. I think we've you talked just to everyone missed today's play. except him. Actually, you didn't. It was the same as yesterday's. I wondered I if you'd still be here. So bad. I had him. a few history questions for you. Lay them on me. Uh. Oh, lots of questions. Yeah. Do you want to just start at the beginning? I want to start with you. Have a lot of puppets. How many do you have? <laughs> you have a lot of puppets. How many do you have? <laughs> Ten in total. King Maria Teresa is my newest addition. I couldn't resist making her the star of the show. Understandable. Are you sure you only have ten? You mentioned to Merrick you were waiting for him to repair your twelfth puppet. Oh, shit. Uh, did, did I say that? You must have misheard me. I meant ten. <laughs> but Maria Teresa starred in your show. She didn't need repair. 
Uh, I'm an actor. I'm not very good with numbers. He knew who I meant. Yes. I suspect he did. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> okay. Do you believe alchemy still has a place in today's world? Do you believe alchemy still has a place in today's world? The alchemy of those days is a dying art. Like my marionettes. Sometimes I think leaving the past in the past might be simpler. Why is it a problem? Wait. You're uh, keeping your traditions alive. I might have been better off sticking with video games. I hate that answer coming from this motherfucker who was like, we're keeping our connection with our culture by doing marionettes. Mm -hmm. And it's like, it's, maybe it's better if we leave the past in the past. Okay. Do you know specifically first. who originally made the Seven Keys? Yes, it is said that Leopold II's royal alchemist made them. Alchemy was a science back then, and kings kept alchemists in their court. You can see evidence of this all over Prague, down to the smallest detail. <laughs> Nothing mystical about forging keys, of course. Do you know his process for forging them? Merrick knows better than I do. I make marionettes dance, but don't really make them physically. He's a master craftsman. Marionettes, keys, you name it. What kind of weird puppet black trade are Merrick and Radek in? Well, they might just be part of the Residente and the yeah. the marionette. The line about the 12th marionette was like a code phrase. There's not actually a secret 12th, 12th puppet or 11th puppet. Uh, I, was, I, was, I was fully assuming there was a secret 12th puppet that was going to be plot critical. <laughs> Like the puppet in the in the puppet tomb. It, uh, in the the box. Yeah. Did you yeah. finish the Residente script? It's still a work in progress. I'm not really sure how to end it. Why is that? Because the Residente haven't finished yet. Most people I spoke with Eyes believe emoji. the Residente disbanded quite a long time ago. I'm not most people. Okay. Also, I would say it was like 50-50 between people being like, nah, the Residente, like, they're not around anymore, or people ominously being, surely the, the Residente wouldn't have anything to do with you, Nancy Drew. You're just a tourist. <laughs> okay. Thanks for your expert analysis. I'll keep it all in mind. Of course. Oh, Nancy, before you go, have you ever read Kafka's Metamorphosis? The mouse folk? <laughs> Not yet, but I know the story. Then you know. The real monsters in Prak, they don't always look it. Hmm. Wow. Okay. <sighs> Do you think we can go ask Radek about the puppet? Marek, you mean? Yes, sorry. Maybe. Pop, Papa I Geppetto. Have to do that. Who have we not asked? We talked to Patrizia. Oh, have we? Uh, no, we did ask Adela. We asked Patrizia and Adela. We haven't asked Leo, but that's because he's fucking kidnapped. Yeah, and I'm pretty sure we asked Marek. Are we supposed to ask the cat? In Leo's stead? I don't know. Are we supposed to ask the international art assassin? Oh, actually, yeah, that makes sense. Or did we do that? He, well, he was like, there's rumblings in the black market, but I don't know if that was in response to the Residente. Can we call the police and ask about the Residente? <laughs> Not available. I'll track down a different lead. I mean, like, we could ask Ned or Frank and Joe to see... I don't know. If they can find any info. Yeah. Can we try calling the police? Yeah, we are supposed to follow up with hmm. them later. Now uh, isn't a good uh, time. Yeah, okay. I guess we haven't talked to it. 
Adela. No, we asked oh, Adela about the resident take. Because remember, okay. she got she got testy about it. Okay. Not available. I'll track down a different lead. Oh. Ah. Oh, sorry. Have you heard of a group called the Residente? Should I have? They follow a long tradition of theft in Prague. So they stole Adela's necklace. Maybe. The necklace seems too small a score for them. If they're going after something bigger, you know what I'm going to say. I'll watch my back. <laughs> I will. Yeah! <laughs> that was my Nancy voice. Great. Thanks. Um, Can we talk to Marek again? Yep. Oh, and did you, sorry, did you try and check off Residente now that we asked Ned to? I keep thinking not that we the learned notebook, but we have a digital Anything. checklist I'm not still have to do that hmm. don't forget to use your phone okay hmm like Oh, oh, can we go fucking Google search the Residente in the cafe or whatever? Yeah, but it said don't forget to use your phone. Yeah, that that's what I... We use a laptop we used... in the cafe. Yeah, we that's true. Google I mean, we, we, we did Google something earlier. We Googled Slipshine. Second Shine. What is it? Yeah second shine but we did that with the yeah. laptop oh, okay oh juliet um says josephine the songstress is about the artist's place in society from the society's point of view like the weird relationship that artists of any sort have to the rest of society supporting and inspiring workers giving a life of labor something magical and extra that exists outside of the labor they are also supported by the people who work harder than them. And they're just people, the same as anyone else. So for them to be seen as exceptional is both true and untrue at the same time. They're unexceptional, but made exceptional by uns- Oh my god, I just got jump scared on the stream. <laughs> my fucking Radix huge zoomed in face. Uh, th for them to be seen as- exceptional is both true and untrue at the same time they're unexceptional but made exceptional by unspoken social decision making which is to say as a puppeteer he should really be saying this is just like josephine the songstress i'm like josephine from that kafka short story unless he believes the evil capitalists are actually turning people into beetles <laughs> i think he's trying to say that the evil capitalists are secretly are beetles on the inside Whoa. Can we go talk to Geppetto now? Hold on. Okay. My cursor was in a weird place and I didn't like it. Like emotionally? No, on the screen. <laughs> Oh, wait, 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 sorry, stop, stop, what? stop, stop. Uh, turn around and look at the building across from you. Up, what does that say? Dum uz lateo rohu. I'm sure that's not how it's pronounced. Huh. Oh, and then okay. it says some other stuff up higher. Oh, on the, like, window. Yes. Yeah. Like... Dignitatis memores and ad optima intend or intenti. Dobre den. 
Don't pretend. Ah. Okay. Oh, we can't even say I should. I get, should oh, get we going. We can't say that. Okay. Yeah. Come back sometime. I do like him. Wow, mm. that puppet. Have I seen the symbol before? It just disappeared. Nancy just ate it. Because there was a marionette in here. Remember? Yeah, and I do. Were like, That's that was the secret puppet. Us? Yeah. I, yeah, I guess we did Have in I our hearts, but yeah. not our inventory. I I guess so. Okay. Hmm. Elka, help us, Elka. Hello. No. Damn. Absolutely not. Emma says, sometimes you get hungry. I guess we can check in with the cafe crowd. Yeah. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. So sorry, Emma. Emma said sometimes you get hungry. Yeah. Not hungry. It's true. And uh, Emma also says if you want to hint LMK. Let's check in with the cafe crowd first. And then if we're still... Uh, where are you? Sorry, sorry, are you distracted was... driving Nancy? Yes, I was slurping. <laughs> I, I could tell. <laughs> We could always make some coffee. I hope you have time to enjoy Prague. A shame to come all this way and not enjoy our history. Hmm. Adela's still here. I have nothing more to say. Okay. Damn, okay. Um, Emma, you want to cook up a hint for us while we make a coffee? that way right i have to touch have to the click on the help one from yeah this please. side oh. oh i don't think we've made a lunago or uh, sorry uh, a lungo yeah what is that it's not on my ah, ah. espresso times three okay i got it just gotta remember what I'm doing here. That's how it's done. One espresso, please. Extra sugar. Um... If someone says extra sugar for something, it that implies that there is already have, sugar in right, it. Like, are, do we do two sugar? I think he, this man wants a cup full of sugar with a single shot. I love in the recipe oh. book doesn't look right okay he only wanted a little sugar i guess um the sticky the sticky note that just says the small portion and for <laughs> recipe i seem to be getting good at this i'd like cafe noisette but can you add a bit more espresso to it wow. got it don't need the recipe wow. don't okay, you put okay, that okay, away okay, i've okay, got it okay i've got it um She's asked for extra extra espresso, right? So that's three espresso. Steamed milk times one. We've said our piece about the uh physics and mechanics of this coffee mini game, but I do like all the little clinking clanks. Those are, they did good with those. Yeah. 
and then hazelnut syrup. Oh, okay. Do you want me to do latte art? Yes, obviously. <laughs> we have a hint if um when you're done with latte art oh my god you're killing it on this one wow you had the favorite. opportunity to serve it before you even uh, finished that's how good it was uh -huh. please use hot water instead of cold also add vanilla syrup nah this one sounds like a pain i'm not making it <laughs> I... You give your coffee order and the person just walks out of the cafe. <laughs> okay. Emma what? says, okay, so you have a way of advancing time in the museum. I believe you've done it before. Take the tour? Yeah, do we click on the sign? Is that what I did before? Mm -hmm. Juliet said, if you were doing latte art and you messed it up and needed to redo it, how would you do that in real life? Like, is there an easy way to scrape off the top and add more? Or do you fill a full layer and then add something else? Um, it would just, in my opinion, as a very probably mediocre barista, you just say well that's what it looks like <laughs> yeah no you yeah you can't you can't <laughs> you shouldn't scrape that off and do it again and no. serve it <laughs> uh like if the latte art was that important like if making it look like a certain thing was that important you would like remake the dr the drink um, um the oh right i forgot what i was doing yeah Oh my god, we're gonna get spooked to grouped again. Welcome to the Hallow stream, baby. Follows the numbers beginning with one. Yoink. <laughs> okay, bye. Uh, did we just get locked in? I should in? check the tour sign again. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Can't open doors, must look at sign. Mm -hmm. That little ar arpeggiated line at the beginning there reminds me of the danger. Um, danger, uh, deadly device soundtrack. I don't remember what that soundtrack sounded like. Well, like I'm it, sure I would if, recognize it, but it's a very like synthy little boop 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 mm. boop boop. Oh, pop that bad boy right in there. Yeah. So. My uh, God! Ah, okay. I see what's happening here. I think it's the other one. It's both. Oh my God! Um. Now we get to take all of them. No, they slide. I don't know if they slide in a particular order, though. Oh. Okay. Okay, so we. Oh, oh, uh, okay. You just look. Yeah, yeah, look. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah I yeah, yeah. see the shapes. Okay. Um, Emma says, "I would simply not mess up. Skill issue."
Um, well, I'll let you slide that one. No, oh, there we it's go. that I have to click the thing, but now I got, I need to swap these two. Yeah. Do you have to bring them all in now and then put it back? Yes. Yeah. Oh my god. A little key. Huh. A little key. Joink. Is that what's it's what is the picture? Is it a little turret? Of, yeah, a tower. Well, I say photograph. I don't know if it's actually a photograph or just a tiny drawing. But it looks, yeah. Oops, photo realistic. Um, can we take the gems back now, or are we just leaving them uh, here? Yeah, I think we're leaving them. Okay. Dobre den. Dobre den. I found a secret compartment in your puppet case. The marionettes and their shows aided the Czech people through many wars. This compartment is no surprise to me. Okay. Okay, no follow-up questions. Going. You yeah. said yourself Come you couldn't sometime. get that trunk open, and we opened it. You're not excited? Huh, a little key. Not allowed to talk to the lesbian. Do you think we should go talk to Oscar about it? Sorry, bro, I took your gems and lost them. I don't know. Let's look. Can't check that off yet. That's done. That's done. Can't check that off yet. Okay. We could try calling the police now. Can't check that off yet. <sighs> Still have to do that. That's done. Okay. Hey. Well, that's something. Hmm. Now isn't a good time. I think we need to talk I to Radic about. Our dad was like, "Send me a reply so I know you're safe, kiddo." And then we just and we just haven't. Oh, we can call him the personal line for Carson Drew. Mm. For legal matters, please contact the firm directly. Otherwise, leave a message or a text and I'll get back to you as soon as I'm available. He sounds so old. <laughs> he sounds just like a little yeah. old man. What were you going to say? Oh, um, we should talk to Radic. As the puppet guy. Hey, Nancy. <laughs> Are the Residente real? You've been reading my script. Yes, they are real. They've been active for centuries. How would someone join them? <laughs> are you considering a life of crime? No, I'm wondering what kind of person they attract. They attract loyal people who care about Proc and its citizens. Honor among thieves. I'm not familiar with this expression. Many regimes in our history made everyday acts a crime. The Residente are not our biggest criminals. Ah, huh. sympathetic to their cause? I like tradition, <laughs> as you can see. I should get going. 
Bye. It does crack me up that he just has his headshot pinned to the <laughs> bulletin board. Okay, now. Now. That's yes. Done. Okay. Check. I'm not done with that yet. Um, Let's talk I'm to wondering... Oscar. Okay, I'm wondering if we are supposed oh, to try to go back into the tunnels oh yeah yes, totally it's pretty clear that the alchemy lab is down there um, yeah yeah i love that idea See, that's why it's all of this stuff was Roddick. It's wild to give him a line that says it would might. What was it? It might have been. It might be simpler to leave the past. It's not that door. I didn't think so, but I couldn't remember what door it is. Left or right? It's behind us. It's behind us. Yeah. It's like right oh, under yeah, the little over... walkway. Yeah. Yes. That um. Sign is. It's wild to give Radek a line that's like, it might have been simpler to leave the past in the past or something. Yeah. Okay. Um. Oh. Out for coffee. Oh, oh we can call the secretary. That's actually great. Great. I think I just now remembered this. I think I had a dream last night where there was a card from a, one of the playing cards for me to pick up. We cuz we haven't found a playing card in so long. Yeah. Where are oh, they? Oh, that looks like an openable drawer. See that one that is a distinctly different color? Yeah. Hmm. Hmm. Ah, there's one. Hmm. 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 Fancy. <gasps> oh. Ah, we're gonna slice and dice. Yeah. Wait. Mm, well, what do I do? Maybe. Though? Cut open that. Yeah. Aha. Uh -huh. Nancy does not eschew the blade. My friend, as I am leaving for Rome, I trust that you will take good care of my beloved Mariash. Here's a short list of my regular tasks. Ensure she has fresh food and water and her bowls are clean. Clean her litter box as soon as she uses it. Spend time with her daily. She loves attention. Playing with her will help her feel less lonely while I'm away. Keep her indoors at all times as she tends to wander off and get lost. Keep an eye on her health and let me know immediately if there are any changes in her behavior. She sometimes pulls books from the lower shelves. You'll have to put them back sometimes. Thank you. Sincerely, Leo. Mariash. That's a cute little name. Mm -hmm. Um, We heard the cat before, and then we didn't ever find the cat. We just... No, we did. She was behind the bookshelf. She she was okay. back in the tunnels. Did, yeah, but and then did she... we... Did we do anything with her? No, I think she just went into the office. I think we just went down the tunnels. But yeah, maybe but that's what I'm wondering. she's in there like, now. Did we free her from being trapped? Did we, you know? Yeah, I think I think okay. so, because we opened the bookcase. Okay. Oh, did we get a magnifying glass on the computer screen? Yes, but I just get the hmm message. Oh, I wonder if we have to turn it on first. And then, like, this magnifying glass is just for the desk in Wait, general. Wait, is it... Ah, uh, do you see we got one on the computer there tower? We there we go. Yes. The one that was on the tower up here was the desk in general one. It yeah. was a finger that showed up for the button. Locked. 
Looks like he and Oscar have a history. Oscar is on your page. UK exhibit closed. Um, time for coffee break. Hurry, off you go. Flight information. Are we supposed to do anything with any of this other than no? Mm. That. Leah's flight. Note OD message. Can we use any of those icons at the bottom? Mail or folder? No. Okay. I mean, we know that... I guess we don't know that Leo and Oscar are beefing. We know that the secretary won't let him in to see Oscar. Won't let Oscar in to see Leo. Yes, correct. Yeah, I mean... Leo literally hasn't been here. Yeah. At the times. Um, Why that um suspiciously colored drawer on the desk is haunting me. Yeah, I know, but I truly I cannot do anything with it. I believe you. It's just haunting me. Ooh, do you see these numbered spines? Are we going to yeah. have a little I bet that means something. Oh, playing card. Oh, yeah. Oh, footprints. see any more down here though that's locked I don't know how I managed to make it out last time because this is like my worst nightmare in terms of navigating. Oh, there's like a cupboard down there. Oh, yeah. Fascinating. And one there. Got a little hangout sesh. Yeah. Um. So, yeah. What? what which way what? shall hold, I hold try on. Will to you, go? Wh what are we getting a hand icon over on the pillar? Can't go that way. Okay. The stairs? Can't go that way. Yeah, I guess. Okay. Because it's treating it as an entrance, maybe? Yeah. Can't go that and way. I can't go around, like, underneath the staircase yeah. either. That's okay. where we just came from. Okay, so. Yes, We yes. can go right or forward. I'm pretty sure that we went forward to escape, so let's go this way. Right. No, the, no, sorry. I meant from the stairs. I think we successfully okay, escaped we down came, this hallway. We, we came from yes. here, right? Yes, I would like to cross across, straight across okay. from here. It's a little spooky gurky. Locked. Okay. Locked. Locked. Wait, do we have? There's the small key. Locked. Okay. Nope. So hold on. Um. Ah, it's just the contact added. Okay. 
cannot go that way. So if we go this way, art. Shapes. Shapes. Okay. Nice little, um, little bench on which to sit and ponder the little puddle. Mm -hmm. Maybe I made it out before because there's actually only one route. Only one path. And yeah. So I just, yeah. It's possible. Okay. Let's go straight here. There's another one of those little cupboards. Okay, so, Let me in. Yeah, so we have like a cityscape with some goats in the foreground here. Beautiful. Yeah, a cupboard. An alcove. I like these lights. Yeah. Oh. Fuck. Oh. Oh, is this the little door? This time, yeah, we can oh. have some side door. Okay. Oh, and we can go back in. I love a door you can Perfect. go in and out of. That's pretty fancy. <laughs> <laughs> okay, this is the other route oh boy okay i'm gonna check this gate yeah also let's look at this look at art these arts. so that we can identify oh horses horses people on horses and oh it's the same hangout sesh that we saw earlier before, but it was halfway in the dark yeah Okay. I'm sure this is locked. Yeah, it doesn't say that this time, but it is. Oh my god. Oh. Okay. Okay. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Hard to see exactly what's happening there, but oh, and then there's this one too. Guy pointing. came from here, right? Found this one, yeah. Yes, okay. A different cityscape, this one with a bridge. Nice little that bridge. That looks like the tower on the, the key. The thing on the key, the it does. Key. Yes. The little key. I, I'm sorry, will you go back and look at that relief one more time? Do you see, it looks like Beneath the bottom corner, if you X out or back out of this thing, it looks like there's a symbol on the wood right there. Oh. It does look like there's a symbol in the wood. That looks like a weird keyhole or something. Is that, well, hold on. Is that... Oh, one of these symbols. Um, I don't think so. It's like similar to zinc or distilled vinegar, but I think it has. Yeah, because it's like, OK, so three dots quite. in an upside down triangle. Let me I'll draw a little diagram of this really fast. Boop, boop, boop. 
And then it's like a little Christmas tree. Yeah. And this is underneath... I mean, I don't know how... I just want to double check this now that I've looked at it more closely. Um... Wow, I don't know that we really appreciated the, um, the, like, drop cap, um, fancy... The font here? What? No, specifically the A, T, and S of Alchemical Table of Symbols. Oh. Yeah. They are something. Okay. Well, a mystery for later. Yeah. Yes. Okay. <laughs> There's too much. God. There's too many I, tunnels. This is why I was terrified before when I started running through these tunnels because I was like, what is going to happen here? Oh. Oh, we haven't seen that before. Sleeping child? Um, oh. Ooh, Medieval this one person. gives me the goosebumps a little bit. Yeah. Oh. Okay, this one we can leave by. Let's go and see where it takes us out of. I'm assuming it's going to be a two-way door. Although I you can make a save so. here if you're nervous yeah, about it. Make a save. Francis says, I love being in creepy tunnels. Two-way door? <laughs> Two-day door. <laughs> Oops. You'd love to type query. I because I can't use a question mark. I I know <laughs> that you can't use a question mark. I think you love to type query. <laughs> I think it brings you joy in your little heart. <laughs> okay, so Oh that's yeah, this is the way that we escaped. Up. Yeah. Yeah. And it is a two-way door. Fuck yeah. Okay, so now we follow the sleeping child. Ooh. 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 That's spooky looking. I don't feel great about that one. But it just appears to be rocks behind there as yeah. well. Go there. No, I think it's just a dark passageway. Oh, oh this that's, is... That's the four-way intersection. Yes. Man, if I had more spatial awareness <laughs> something than I do I would be able to like make a map of this yeah but that's never gonna happen okay is this yeah no through way also no I bet way. that the alchemical the um, alchemy lab is behind this one with the weird little keyhole. Yes. I'm, yeah. Somehow, or it's gonna open a door or unlock something like that. That's a little situation for us. Emma says, "I need to go advance laundry. So if you need a hint in the next five to ten minutes, my advice is don't." Damn. Um, okay, but does that mean we just don't get to access the alchemy lab yet? Her snaps. Can we, um... This is not how this game works. I was like, let's take a picture of the keyhole. But that's not how the game works. That won't do anything for us. Yeah. Um, are there other... I... Uh, I got lost in the sauce of this, these hallways. Are there other little turnings that we haven't explored? Uh, I do not think so. Okay. Yeah, because we came from here. The others are dead ends. We came from here originally. We just went down there and explored all the options. Yeah. Um, we do know that that piece of artwork is pretty close to the, that like 
downward ramp entrance. So Mm -hmm. when we need, if we want to go go there, we can get to it from the downward ramp entrance. Exactly. I no fucking idea, dude. Oh, we're that. almost back. Yeah, we're okay. at the front. Yeah, because the other way is the little pondering bench for the puddle. Yeah. Well. Well. Oh, wait. How do we get back? Oh, uh, we can go out either of the other I entrances. Mean, yeah. Can, but yeah. we cannot go. Can we not? go back i don't we can't go know. back up the stairs for some reason oh yeah because i guess that's where we came from was the stairs yeah but we we're not allowed way. to okay i guess okay um when we get out we should call the secretary Is that a- locked locked um yes I was just trying to remember the closest that closer exit ah just right here yeah okay yeah this is the weird little door on the side yeah, yeah. Um. let's call that secretary okay Hello. I hope English is all right. My name is Nancy Drew. I'm trying to reach the Dean. English is quite all right. I'm afraid Mr. Sokol is not available at the moment. I'm investigating a case. Maybe I could speak with you. If I can be of any help. Ah, here we go. I feel like just starting with this the cathedral hold any pressure. <laughs> <laughs> Can please start with it, please? Yeah. Does the cathedral hold any precious treasures? There are many priceless artifacts in tomb of the saints here, and all the crown jewels. I'm sorry, what? The crown jewels are in the cathedral. Where they lie, I truly cannot say, but I believe they are secure in a vault beneath us. Who has access to them? Not me, I can assure you. As for the rest, it is not my place to say. I'm I'm Martin, the Magnus Archives sounding motherfucker. (laughs) Yeah. Um... Yeah, if anyone is playing bingo and has not crossed off inexplicable NPC accent, he does count for that. Mm-hmm. Even though they're gonna give us you an explanation of some kind, how did you come to work I for still the think D? it's inexplicable. I'm native Czech. I watched a great deal of telly growing up and studied in England. Hmm. I thought I could have sworn that you had trouble speaking Czech. I find many problems disappear on their own, if I only speak in English. Clever. My job is to filter, ma'am. That's what I do. Uh Um, okay. Do you know why Oscar Dvorak is trying to reach the Dean? He's not disclosed his agenda to either of us. Why do you think he wants to meet? As head of the gems exhibit in the museum, he has no oversight on the cathedral or its renovation. He has lodged several memos on the subject. What does he want? I can only surmise he wants unfettered access to the treasures of the cathedral that he has no respect for. Is Leo avoiding Oscar Dvorak? 
It is my duty as his secretary to filter through priorities. You never told him. I filtered, ma'am. <laughs> Thank you for your time. Of course. When the Dean returns, I will let him know that you called. Please do. Hmm. Okay. Um. Uh, hmm. what was our new clue? We've learned, we've learned the check words for the days of the week. Oh, from the calendar. Yeah. And on his computer. Sure. Um. Still have to do that. Can we? Okay. Not yeah. available. I'll track down a different lead. Damn. I'm wondering if there's more in Leo's office. Office? Yeah, let's go back in there and poke around. And let's see if, if we can find that to. fucking cat. Yeah. Mariash. Um, yeah, because... Yeah, this is a puzzle. books have so many numbers on them. And it said sometimes the cat pushes books. books Pulls off, books off the notch yeah, bottom shelf. Yeah. Lower shelves. But if I click on that, I'll go through. Um... More numbers. Damn. Oh. <gasps> Another card. Fuck yeah. And a check. We can steal a check. Uh, check another check. kind of check. <laughs> Got a check. 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 I want to read Prague at Play, a history of old world games, to learn how to play the game. We don't have enough cards to play yet. Yeah. Weird spacing going on here. Yeah. Claire's supposed to be one more bookshelf right there. <laughs> hmm. Oh, camera security camera. Seems like if he was kidnapped, there should be security footage, but I don't know if anyone is looking at it because they don't realize that he's missing. Although, I guess we reported it to the police. Oh god, his body. If this was a different game, his body would be hidden in this, yeah. right? Yeah. Oh, we just. There was a. I think it was just for clicking on this. Hmm. Maybe. Hold on. Okay, so it's for clicking on that. Yeah. Okay, it's yeah, just it's just the desk. 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 That um Oh, are those the copper coins that were on um Sir Nicholas the Sad's crest? Oh probably. Maybe. Emma's back. Um, um we're poking around Leo's office. We talked to the KG secretary.
Did we see? I want to see what's on the. Oh no, it's a blotter. Yeah. Yeah, not a ink pad. Oh. Can we no. use his phone? No, I'm clicking. It's not doing mm. anything. Maybe we did something. We did. We listened to his voicemails before mm. when we were here. Okay, right, right, right. Oh, that. Oh, it's just a plant again. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Damn. And Mariash is nowhere to be heard or seen. Yeah. And this puzzle unlocked the bookcase. Yeah. Oh, maybe this is just the way desks are made because. Remember, this one has the off-colored drawer, and oh, we did yeah. actually open that one. So I guess that's just the desk model. I guess so. Mm, do you see the rug is rocked up? Yeah. That maybe is just artistic and not... Maybe that's a little mariage shape for mariage, um, having done that for years. Maybe. Yeah, I'm not getting anything. Yeah. Um. Dang. Yeah. Can we really not access anything? in the tunnels right now or like do something else in this office we looked around the secretary's desk there's not really much more to this inside space right it it attaches to the museum check oh oh okay check yeah we haven't done still that still have though. to do that Can't check that off yet. Hmm. Okay. Yeah. Um, can we look around the rest of this little interior yeah. space? Not necessarily the secretary's office. Yeah, but... I just want to double check. Yeah, of course. The office while we're here. Yeah, yeah, it's it's clearly just the same model and that's yeah. why it has the suspicious drawer. <laughs> that's funny. It makes sense. Do we look at all those little built-in shelves in the other hall? I think oh, so. Oh, I love the I middle knob. I'll come back to it in a minute. Yeah, so this is the Yeah, the museum. To the museum. Oh, we still have to tell Oscar. We're going to get in trouble with him cuz the gems are I think that might be a plot advancing thing for us. Mm. Right? Yeah, I guess so. I hadn't thought about that, but yeah. Put her in park. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Man, we don't even get a bar clanking. Yeah. Okay, let's go fucking fess up to Oscar, I guess. And we looked at this little table with the... Uh, yeah. Oh, yeah, and this is... That's the... Is that the 22 character Latin alphabet that is on the thing? I think it is. That yeah, it looks like it. That we read on Leo's desk. I feel like this is gonna be a puzzle but it's not yet yeah yeah agree agree oh emma says can you open your inventory for me so i can see something 
And Francis says, it's good to have one suspicious drawer so you know where not to store your secret things. Yeah, so I can't, there's no opening um, of in. Let's just read through what we, we have, have really the fast. Book, Alchemy's Golden History. We have Adela's list of suspects. We have a snow globe. We have an iron key. Wait, hold on. Oh, I fucking forgot. Little key. That's for the little yeah, key. Maybe. Don't I hope get so. your hopes up. <gasps> my hopes are up. Oh, oh my god. Side moved. Oh, <gasps> that's the that that's symbol. the fucking thing. The that's the fucking thing. Below hide secrets lost. Bro, and that's our tunnels, fucking key. I know. Have allegedly been um created by floods. By the so, floods. Yeah. Okay. Even though they forgot to put that well, dialogue in. <laughs> something changed inside the snow globe. What does it mean? I can't believe we forgot about the tiny keyhole. Wait, okay. We're gonna... We're gonna no, swing by I Oscar. Wanna... No, I... we're gonna swing by Oscar. <laughs> then we're gonna go out of this entrance and go... And go down the, the little ramp. ...from the easier yeah. one. <sighs> Nancy. He okay. doesn't even care. It's fine. He doesn't even... He hasn't noticed, because he can't fucking open it. We're golden. <laughs> Perfect crime. Oh my god, this is thrilling. Wait. Is this right, or is this the way out? Left? Yeah. Yes. Okay. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh my god. Hmm. Nancy. Nancy. Has nobody ever found this? It's oh! <laughs> Okay. Um Are we going to put these on? Yeah. Yes. So, we can only Let's put Oh. Light. Oh. <laughs> My god. So we can okay. only put okay. them on the pegs. On the posts. And, then and we have these, these raised are going to block light. Yeah. Oh, this is so exciting. But I don't know. So see the the beam of light coming in from the top left. Oh right, it's a uh, yes. Yeah. So we're reflecting it, and ref can you rotate these or not? Yes, I can. Ooh, wow, that's a real little light sound. Yeah. Um. Oh, yeah, and then we can take it down around that and back up to the other side. Yeah. I'm wondering about this peg right here. Like... Yeah. No, because that's not gonna... Oh. I wasn't looking. Some oh, of to these let it... are three-way and one of them is a four-way. So we have Interesting. two three-way junctions and one okay. four-way. Four -way. This is really cool on the relief sculpture so you can see all the, like, reveals all the little details is really fun. Yeah. So one of the three ways it's going to have to go. Yeah. Thinking. That doesn't need to be a three way. Oh, unless you oh, think. Oh, no, we... it doesn't. Well, this one is raised. I wasn't. Yeah. Paying attention to that. But I also don't know if every peg needs a thing. Like, it, I don't know ugh. why there's a peg. One, two, three, here. four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six. No, there's more pegs than there are little doohickeys. 
So not every peg is going to receive a doohickey. Okay. I would assume it's that, because she said, let there be light or something. So I would assume it's about... Yeah. Just right now... Can we... The one that is... Um, in the middle row, second from the right, can we put a three-way there so it also shines light through it? Oh, yes. Yes. I'm also... Because that's how we'll pass the light through to that Sorry, entire which section. One? Middle row, second from the right. This? Correct. And you'll rotate it. Yeah. Like yeah. that. And then... Send it down. Yeah. I think we'll have to use a three-way there too. Well, yeah. So I have a, I have four-way, four-way. Interesting. Left, which we don't need there. But it makes me wonder. All right, try it there. Oh. We have a problem. Yeah. Which is how do we send stuff? Oh, because yeah. the the one in the top row in the middle needs that one needs to be a three way. That's the only way to send light. That's the this. only thing that aligns. Yeah, the only thing that aligns with. Or we need to send the right. Oh, uh -huh. there we go. Yeah, I mean, that's better, but um, this square needs to be lit up. And oh, right. We can do that. This. Right. But we have one but dead spot, that, right? Yeah. Yeah, but this can go there. And then flip a Yes. Beautiful. <gasps> Francis says, not every peg is going to receive a doohickey. I am always saying this. Oh my god. Whoa. Oh my god. This must be the old alchemy lab. Okay, I'm gonna say something horrible. It's time. It's time. Yeah. But but we get to start on a strong note yes. next time. Oh! oh look at that. That is what I love to see. That is beautiful. Hold on. Wow. I'm sure those are the same dried herb assets from uh, Midnight. From the little shop. Mm. Yeah, maybe. I'm not done with that yet. Check. That's done. Oh my god. Still have to do that. Okay. Okay. Wow, what a productive stream. I feel like we really powered through some stuff. The really cool snow globe I got from Patrizia ended up having its key inside. Ended up. Ha oh, right. Ended up ha having yeah. its key inside Marek's puppet compartment. It's a weird way to phrase it. What a small world. What a small world. What a puppet puppet scale world. Thrilling. Thrilling. <laughs> oh, I thought you were spelling laboratory and I was very <laughs> confused. <laughs> Lab a boy oh boy. <laughs> That's it. Wow. That's... It feels like we're fucking playing a Nancy Drew game. The puzzle, the snow globe, like, yeah. inverting to make the key that yes. we had anticipated was real satisfying. That was good, and that puzzle, yeah, to get in here was great. Um, good work. Yeah, that was... I mean, that one's fun, because that that's, like, a pretty basic puzzle formula, but I, I thought, like, the light 
showing the detail on the relief sculpture was genuinely really sick. Yeah, it was nice. Um, well, thank you everyone for coming to yeah. another installment of Secret of the Seven Mystery of the Seven Keys. Yeah. The Secret Mystery Keys 7 Puppet yep. Boy. Yep. Oh boy. Um, I'm Wesley. You can find me on Twitter at Horse Archivist or Instagram at Rose and Fiddle Fiber Arts. Oh, excuse me. Um, you can find us on Twitter at Root Detectives. And joining me, uh, my fellow alchemist is... Uh, Leo, you can find me on Twitter at Chalo and Behold. Hell yeah. We will be back as usual next week and every week until November 3rd. That's several weeks. Yes, it's a few, at least. I would not say More several. than one. Yeah. Uh, is that all? I think so. Um, I was going to end out on, on, end on a puppet noise, but puppets don't have a famous uh, noise and or catchphrase. Yeah. Do they? Uh, I... Not that I know of. Yeah. Cl clickety clack. Yep. I'm made of wood. Strings pulling. Ah. Boy, that really pulls my strings. Okay. Good night, everyone. <laughs>